the, the moment where I'm really alive is in the moment of the creation of a piece of painting. I think the most the artist is to, this hope for, for a better world. What can we do? It doesn't help for me to, to paint blood and horrible things that we see every day. But if we can transform it into something beautiful, something optimistic for our future, that's, I think that is our, our job. When I was about 18, I left Norway. I come from the north of Norway. And I went to Paris, and it was in this wonderful time where everything happened in Paris. And when I was 21, I had my first one woman show in Paris, in Galerie de l'Université. And that's many, many years ago. Then when I was 37, I came to Egypt. But for me, it was in a way like coming home. I just felt so, uh, so happy here. I love Egypt. Egypt has been very kind to me, and I love the people here. And when I had my first exhibition, when I came to Egypt, in the, uh, the Italian culture center in Somali. And then the paintings were 10,000, 20,000, and all the artists got crazy. Who is this woman coming with these prices? And it lifted them all up. And that's, that was a good thing. But now they are going on and on, and I stay. And they said, why do you stay? You have to go higher up. But I feel you have to be so people can afford to buy your work. Because why paint if you cannot have it in your home? That's the message. Every time I sell a painting, I buy from another young artist. Because I think we have to do that. The ones that are successful have to help the ones that are coming up. That's the future. It's very important for a country to have music and good writers and good painters. But we will not have it if we don't support these people. But there are no critiques in Egypt. You go to Paris or in Oslo, and you have tough critics that will either kill you or, or make you. But here it, it's very soft. It is if people love what you do. You know, now I'm so old, I don't care, you know. But maybe when I was very young, I, I loved to have good critics. And if it was bad, it was certainly a stupid critic. <laughs>